Welcome back, people. Playing some more Bannerlord. Should have had an episode out to you already, but, uh, well, <laughs> I had the audio corrupt on me twice in about two hours of gameplay. So, I'm trying this again. I think I've fixed the problem. Just FYI, if you're getting coil wine in this game, what you hear, it sounds like crickets. It sounds like a little, little low cricket noise. Persistent wine. Uh, go into your performance. No, video. Yeah, performance. <laughs> Is it in here? No. It's under video. Turn on VSync, either full or half, and that'll help you. Basically, the game is going off the rails with uh, its FPS. Like, it was almost pegging out my 2080 Ti. Going up to like 80%. On certain menus. Really weird. But, that seems to have fixed the glitch. I don't have any weird crackly audio on my recordings. So, we're going to continue. But, to catch up on what you missed, because <laughs> you missed a lot. Uh, I joined... Because these guys are starting to steamroll, and in one of my playthroughs, they steamrolled across everywhere. The Volandians. Uh, I decided to go with the Sturgeons. And in doing so, in some of the fights that I've been in, I uh, got captured. <laughs> because our army got destroyed. It was not decimated. That is 10% of the military. It was destroyed. And I got captured. In my clan, which is... Actually, tier one now. While we were in prison, Mr. Durngle here got himself ransomed, and I had to sit there and wallow until I could escape. And then I had to go find my companions and get him back. There's not a whole lot to the, the gameplay in the prisons yet. So we'll see if that changes over time, but whatever. Let's look at our party. Got some Sea Raiders here. I got a decent sized party. I can plus it up a little bit. But I've been doing. Doing quests in the towns, getting stuff. Uh, let's look at my dude. Pretty well outfitted. I got some male mittens and stuff. Got a decent horse. If we look at my character, I've leveled a few things up over time. I'm kind of going more for the the leadership route now. Working on charm, engineering, tactics. I think I'm a mercenary right now. I'm trying to become a vassal. It's not going as well as I'd hoped. It's not working as easy. Let's do this one. These are pretty good quests. You get in there. You get in there and you crack some skulls in town. Gain some favor. All right, he's got that rival. I feel like they could, like this could become a pretty good uh, gameplay loop. Where you do stuff in uh, the seedy underbelly of towns and never quite actually work for one of these guys. Saw for prisoners. Do we have a bunch of junk in our inventory? Uh, yeah, well, their shoes can go. We'll keep the rest. That should be fine. Does anybody need kit? A Temer Break Skull here, he doesn't have that much. Oh, that's a little booty upgrade for him, and he needs bracers. There we go. I think that'll do. Let's get to moving. Well, we got a few days until that kicks off, so we're just going to go plus up our men. We've only got 677 bucks. Ooh. Nope, I don't want to spend on upgraded troops. I just want your cheap dudes. I'm all about them cheap dudes. Let's go out this way. Check it out. I've been playing around with the different mechanics as far as, I guess, uh, smithing. I've played with that. I've played a little bit with trade. I still have a lot of work to do with that. Why am I going so slow? I guess it's because I'm going through woods. Ooh, that's a juicy target. Let's go get him. Doing looters as much as possible is good, because you can get your tactics up pretty easily. Alright, surrender or die, scum. And 
we're going to attack. I'm going to let my men do most of the work here. I have cavalry. Generally, I'll move my archers up front. Infantry! Leave them there and then rush them forward when I need to. And we'll have our Infantry! good old cavalry Kill them all! skirmish with them. It's good to have them do a few charges here, break them up a little bit. I do like the aspect of leading men in this. Almost better than I like the combat, but I do enjoy the combat as well. I'll move them off to that left flank. See if I can get a hit here. Some uh, wet work done. Ooh, I missed. Oh, he's done. Not bad, not bad. Actually, really good. It's a good time to practice your tactics whenever you can uh let's get one more then and two more footmen take that looter we'll take all their junk got some wine out of it not bad all right it's always good to practice let's come back here to zaman they're good how am i doing no points to spend. I have temporarily been able to allot points here. But not always. I think it's broken right now. Got troops you got. You got the cheap guys. Nice. See, those aren't the cheapest. That warrior is not. I don't want him yet. I'm trying to save my money. Sell off this junk. We're doing good on food. That doesn't seem to be a problem. Uh, let's go back. And we'll head out of this town. There's no quests to do. So we're mainly just buying time for this one to kick off. Oh, Godin created an army. Maybe I should go find him. Joining the armies is a good way to get good experience in a lot of things. Uh, let's take these dudes. What do they have for products? I'll get some grain. If I join an army, the problem with joining an army, let me put it this way, is if they run out of food, you're going to have to give up some of yours. So having extra is always good. Let's make our way this way. He's way down here by Cranog Castle. Still got this quest we got to take care of. Just waiting. So if you go into the smithy, this is relatively easy to do. You can only do so much in a day. You can smelt down your weapons in your inventory into base components, which is actually a good way to do it if you have junk. So I should probably not be selling that off. But you need hardwood that you can turn into charcoal, so a two to one ratio. I think if you get the perk, you can uh, get more charcoal out of each wood. But this is your base material for any smelting, or any forging, rather. Or smelting, yeah, true. Uh, yeah. And then you come in here, and you can unlock these by just crafting. You'll unlock new designs and get better at it. 
So you just pick what you're trying to make, but you really only start with one and then, uh, yeah, you just craft it. So it's going to take four wrought iron, one crude iron, one hardwood, one charcoal. So it tells you what you need. Like if I make it bigger, I don't think it really matters that much. But yeah, get your uh, smithing skill up by refining hardwood. Let's come back over here. Who's that? Let's go talk to Lashonic. Actually, screw him. Let's go to Vilder. Vilder. At least introduce ourselves a little bit. Nope, nothing to do there. No quick cool questions. Time to go. Alright, we're ready. Ooh. I gained two skill points in stewardship. Awesome. What did I gain in here? Uh, oh, stewardship. Okay. So I gain more taxes or... I guess I'm not a ruler, so I don't really gain that influence. Uh, I guess I'll get more taxes. That'll be good for later. We'll continue. Are we going to deal with these guys? Sell off that looter. Ransom them, not sell them. Not sell them into slavery. Totally not it. Alright, let's go talk to her and take care of this problem. The Sturgeons have kind of become a underdog in this playthrough. They may always be an underdog, I don't know. Not really sure. Let's go deal with this problem here. <clears throat> Oi. All right, drunk at the anvil. I gave my word. <laughs> that didn't work. <laughs> Got a little bit of lag on me. My dude should do fine. Or not. <laughs> I don't think I've ever lost one of those. Okay, well. That was interesting. <laughs> Alright, well, good talk. Good talk. Yeah, I'm hurt pretty bad. I guess we'll just come back here and lick our wounds a little bit. Interesting. Interesting. <laughs> well, now you know what happens if you uh, fail one of those. You just get knocked out. Wait here a little bit. Heal up. So you heal quicker when you're in town. I think I've got somebody that's got a doctor skill. All right, we got a doctor. Or a doctor. We got an army. Vildur is right here. Let's go down here. Let's help him out. Let's go do something. Hopefully get into a big siege. Oh, there he is. Let's go find him. We'll join him. Ah, come on, dude. Help him out a little bit. I will try to get into some alternative gameplay, like the smithing stuff, and figure that out. Or setting up caravans. I think that would be interesting. His army is growing. Oh, come on, dude. Like, if it's on your faction, you should be able to just follow it. Alright, he's assembling here. I'm gonna buy more food while I'm at it. How much do I have? I don't have that much money. We'll buy that. That'll give us some provisions. And I'm gonna join his army. And now we just wait. For everybody to come around. Well, there's the king. Rangabad. We're going after a castle. Oh yeah. 286 isn't that many to take a castle. It's probably enough, but... It's a little dicey. So you can see the Volandians have really taken it to, uh... Well, pretty much everybody. But here in particular. Alright, we're gonna hang out with them. So, the way this works is you build your siege camp first. They're going to try to build up fortifications and uh, well, counter artillery. <laughs> and then you build your different siege equipment. Well, you can have ballistae, ballistae, siege towers, and battering ram. 
the siege camp will provide you with, uh, holy shit. <laughs> well, I might go into prison again, boys. I get to lead something. I will lead the horse archers. Follow me! Get the horse archers with me, and then we'll go out there into the field. I have pretty much maximum number of troops set for the limit on this. Uh, yeah. So you control a contingent within the within the army as a commander. They're not just your troops; they're everybody's. You see a smattering of both. I'm really waiting on orders. There we go, turn that on. There we go. Yeah, this thing is pissing me off. There we go, fixed it. <laughs> I don't have any orders yet, so I'm just waiting. Go deal with this cavalry over here. At least draw them off the flank. Skirmish on mount. You got it, buddy. Apparently I went out of the, the area. <laughs> Let's come back. Keep the horse archer skirmishing. Ooh, I just dodged him. <laughs> Keeping them tied up, so at least the infantry can do their thing. There he goes. Stay behind in reserve, okay. A little harder said than done there, buddy. Alright, well, I will do just that, boss. <laughs> oh, I'm down. That ain't good for me. Need to find a horse. Attack! Yeah! Ow! Fuck! Oh, there's a horse. And we're back up. Oh god, almost lost it already. They're in charge mode now. Oh, I'm already on it, boss. Doing what I can out here. Oh, I almost got hit by a couch lance. Oh, jeez. Oh, I'm down. I did my part. <laughs> well, so we're just going to tool around with this ding dong. Hopefully we can escape before he gets somewhere to put us in prison. That'd be nice. Or somebody will fight him. He'll free us. Where is she? She's a prisoner. So these guys escaped. Alaska stayed with me, my surgeon. We got a fight here. Apparently, I can't see it though. <clears throat> well, that's unfortunate. Was well, he gonna join me as a prisoner? These guys are just steamrolling shit. Hopefully they get attacked by banditos and then all die. That'd be great. Well, he's running from something, I think. Nope, he's going to Krenna. Oh, I'm going to get put in there, aren't I? No? Damn it. Hoping he'd die. Well, we'll see if we get out of this. No, he didn't put me in there. That's surprising. That is really surprising. more dudes. And this is really fun watching these guys. <laughs> I 
Eventually I'll get to escape. Eventually. See, this had some other game loops in it. Oh, yep, yeah, now I'm in prison. I'm thrown in a dungeon. Not much to do, so I'd sit here and uh, toil away. Twiddle my thumbs, as it were. The problem is, once I escape, I've got to make my way out. Fortunately, it's not deep in enemy territory, which was what happened last time. I was like way back in uh, Sargat, I think, and I had to go through enemy lines. See, did any of our people get ransomed yet? <laughs> yeah, the Empire is a little OP. I think that's probably by design. But it might be a little too OP. Alright, well, I'll come back to you guys once I get out. Oh, I broke free. I don't want to break free yet. There's, there's enemies. Got the GTFO. <laughs> Let's see. Can I see any of my people? Let's get my party. No troops. So, they're in uh, Balgard, Salmon, and Rebel. So, I got to go pick up Durangul. That sneaky bugger. Salmon. How much money do I have? Ah, Jack. <laughs> I am broke. Gotta get away from him. Let's go to neutral territory here. Gotta go find Durngill. I think he's in the tavern, isn't he? Sure is. So it's a, it's a game of bringing your men back together. Durngill. Good day. Join my party. And let us ride. Alright, we gotta go back and find the rest of our party. We'll go fight some banditos. I'll try to. So I know some are in, uh, Bulgard. One's in Rebel, so we gotta go to Rebel first. Just gonna slowly push our way through. And hopefully we don't get smoked by one of these guys. We can move really fast. Okay, I guess we're fighting. Let's do this, you scum. Take on the looters. Give them hell! Let's get after this. Duo. Almost got him in the foot. Yeah! Little spearmint here. Oh, we got some oh, renown. much health I gotta be careful I'll keep him uh, distracted while he comes in Drungo this is all you buddy nice oh, <laughs> almost got poked there's one hit I do like how the rocks will like bounce off the horse and he's down, right in the face, right in his stupid face. Oh shit! Don't go, take him down. Nice. Don't go, save my life. You are forgiven for your abandoning me last time I was in prison. <laughs> take all this junk and get out of here. Man, I lost a lot of my uh, a lot of my pack animals, unfortunately. Let's make our way back here. Varchek is under siege. Oh, that's not good. That's not good at all. That is a... Oh. Well, who's... Do they have a lot of people? Yeah, not good. Not good. Let's uh, go back here. This whole side of our empire... Yeah, it's gone. <laughs> that was it was quick. So you can join the battle lines, but you have to break through and you will lose some of your men. Let's go back here to Rebel. Man, this is rough. 
We'll cross back up there and go get our men. Uh, let's go to the tavern, because clearly he's going to be at the tavern. Ransom those guys. We're going to go down to our party members yet again. Alright, so there he is. Temmer. Join my party. Let's get back out there. We're going to trade and sell off this junk. All right. Yeah, I'm not doing a quest for you right now, buddy. Got to keep moving. Got to go get the rest of my men. This is always the fun part, rebuilding. Whenever you can. Let's keep moving. Yeah, Varchek is done. We gotta sneak past this line now. God, they control everything. Yeah, the Blandians might be a little OP. Maybe. Good. Sneak in back here. And I guess we'll fight more looters. It's fine by me. We'll get some more experience, more renown, and keep it going. Well, you're on foot. Effort attack! Footman! Let's get in there. One hit. Ow, shit. Almost got him. Some hits on there. Come in and help uh, the skull breaker here. Nice. And he's down. And I'm down. Don't go. It's up to you, brother. Nice. One more down. Durgill's actually pretty good. Come on, boy. Take him down. He's Sterngill. Just stacking them bodies. Two more to go. That guy with the pitchfork is the biggest threat, really, in this scenario. <laughs> ah, nice, good hit. Oh, shit. Sterngill, take him down, buddy. Oh, shit. Come on, dude. This is uh, turning into a very interesting playthrough. <laughs> I've been captured by one. I mean, we can break free here, kill him. Or somebody will kill them and free us. That'd be great. Looks like we have peace. Okay, well, that's, that's good, I guess. I can pay 300... Uh, Hmm. When a captor comes near you with an offer, he proposes to free you in return for 308 bucks. I'll accept the offer. Oh, roguery. Interesting. Well, now I need to get away from him. <laughs> or I'm dead. So, my party is back to nothing. We're playing a lot of uh, back and forth here, so we gotta go to Revel again. Going down south. Double back. It's only one of them. Who do they have? No prisoners, so. Okay, well. Guess we're not dealing with that. Let's make our way over here, here to Rebel again. Try to build up our forces yet again. At least this time we don't have to deal with the Volandians as a problem. That piece has been struck. They have reached an accord. Alright, I'm just going to do this the quick and easy way. Just take them to your party, make it easier. Let's go back to town. Um, yeah, I got nothing there. I am so broke. This is, this is tough. 
I have fought well for the Sturgeons, so maybe, maybe they'll take me on as a vassal in their meager empire now. Need the Vlandians to go to war against everybody else. We gotta go up here to Belgard. That'll get us two more of our men. Our companions, rather. We gotta rebuild our base forces. There's Fafin's army. Let's look at the kingdom. Currently, diplomacy. We're not at war with anybody, so that's good. It'll be a time for the time for the Sturgeons to rebuild and give us a chance to. Get ourselves going. Thank you. Let's see, can I talk to him and declare myself as a vassal of the Volandians? Hmm. Nope, I don't have anybody to marry. Uh nope. Okay, you got nothing for me. So good good day, sir. Let's come up here to Balgard and get our two companions. I think it's two. Might just be one. Let's go to the tavern. Yep, we got Talia and uh, Alaska. Take them to my party. Take them to my party. You I don't have in my party yet, and I am broke. I need to do something. Let's see. I'll escort a merchant caravan. I can do that. <laughs> Actually, I may just go into the arena and earn a little bit of money there just fighting. I gotta leave for now. I'm not gonna do the caravan. So when you talk to those guys, you can set up caravans. And go about it that way. That's a good way to get leadership. Let's go to the arena. Hey, there's a tournament. Let's join it. Let's see what we can get out of this. I don't have any money to bet, but at least I can get a horse. <laughs> Oh, there's another hostile. With him. Come on, Archer. There you go. Right on cue. That was good. What good? Skip that round and we'll join. Get some spearmen. You actually have to place your shield. You can't just go shield up and win. <laughs> Skip that round and we'll fight Ulrich Frostbeard X to X. He is not well armored, so he should be easy. Ooh. We'll shield bash. I 
guy's not very good at archery. And neither am I, for that matter. One of the best strategies you have in these is let them kill each other. I feel like some hostiles are going to spawn anytime now. Suck it bad. Oh shit. Where'd I get it from? I got it. Ooh. Almost took an axe to the face. Right in the side of the head. That's that's painful. I might take a few days to sleep that one off. Okay, so that's not really a great right way to make money right now. <laughs> Not that good. Let's go ahead and uh, escort this merchant caravan. We'll see where it's going. And I've still got to pick up somebody. Got to figure out where they're at. Or do you need help with a problem there, my man? Go on. Let's do it. Earn a little bit of money from Yorig the Minter. Get our party real quick. Uh, who needs a horse? Because I got a new one. It requires 90 riding though. So he could have one. There's only one guy that can ride it. What does he have? A desert horse? Congrats. You've been upgraded, Dringle, for your performance in saving my ass a few times. Where is my other party member? Okay, so they're not far. <clears throat> we'll follow these guys and figure out where they're going. Going to Sibir. Which is not far. It's just over the hill. Speed things up. I guess I'm fighting 13 dudes. Great. Fight me if you dare, you scum. It's going to be a little tougher. Curl them all! Sending everybody in. Chuck some of these... Uh, Little guys in on the croup. Yeah, there we go. Somehow I missed in that entire group. <laughs> One hit. It's amazing what a good bit of companion cavalry can do. I got so much of looters. <laughs> <laughs> or nothing more than a bunch of peasants with rocks and sticks. One down. This can work. This can work. Gotta get rid of that pitchfork guy. He's a problem. You get the stragglers too. Nice. Axe him. He's my target. Oh, shit. Come on, you little bugger. Really hard with a short sword to do anything on a horseback. Finish him, please. Okay, I'll do it myself. Right. excited. <laughs> Take all that loot for me. Got some grapes. Good, we got some food. There's one way to replenish yourself. Let's go to uh, Takeor and sell off some junk. Maybe get some dudes. Slowly rebuild our forces. Get rid of that pickaxe. Great. Now we have a little bit of money. Let's get a couple of guys here. 120, that'll work. That will work. Now we actually have a force. <laughs> Slowly rebuilding. See, it's more fun to play as the underdog in these games. Sea Raiders over the hill. 
it makes for a more interesting campaign. You can just go steamroll everything and then get everything for yourself. But playing as somebody other than the Empire is great. Based on my experience so far. Oh shit. Well, I'm gonna let them get attacked and then come in and help. Because I feel like that's gonna be a better option. I don't want to get into any unnecessary fights. 18 looters, ugh. See, before, that's an easy target. And now that I'm rebuilding my forces, it's a little tougher. You can really pay attention to your, your fights. Yeah, I got him. I could recruit him. Let's do that. Any men. Welcome aboard, looter. I think you need a certain perk to be able to upgrade those guys, too. To the next tier. Let's get a spear. See what's going on here. There's a healer I could get. Yeah, there's a tournament. Let's do it. I'm all for doing tournaments. Get free loot. I'm not going to bet anything because I don't really have anything to bet. Oh, this is a big melee. Good help. Good on you, buddy. Drungil, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Brosif. Get my shield up. Not get shot in the face. That'd be great. Come on, you bastard. Take this horse and uh, go do some things. Whoa! <laughs> a ragdoll horse. That was awesome. All right, all right. I think I'm advancing regardless, but I, of course, want more kills because that's what you do. Oh, yeah. Come on. Of oh, course. He's getting his ass chopped. Come on. I'm going to get a little distance and come in for a charge. Or not. Oh. Man, that horse is pretty good. <laughs> Skip that round, and then we're going in. Vesh Corey. All right, you and I. The noble wants to fight me, I guess. Oh. Oh. Come on, you, you rich bastard. Never been in prison. Stab in the back. Kill stealing bastard. Well, at least he's not going on. Should be an easier fight. All right, two on two. We got this. Gotta get him down. I, got, I think I got the horse on that one. Every once in a while, a shield bash is really useful. Shit. Oh, 
I'll throw off their little cycle of block and attack. Oh, shit. My guy's on foot now. That's not good for me. I got a swordsman that I gotta deal with. Come on, horse guy. Fuck. I could really use your help right now. About to lose my shield. Yep, great. Real helpful teammate there. Took his horse out, but not him. Let's see what he does. Oh, he's done. <laughs> Basically, game over for him. Guess that's the problem when you have a bowman on horseback with a sword. It's helping you out. Skip that. Horse, horse shit. All of it. Okay, well, we'll continue with what we're doing. Where's he going? He's going back to uh, Kaz. Where the hell is that? Six looters, yeah, I'm not quite in position to help that. Oh, we're at war with the Western Empire now. Who who that? Oh great. Well, that's gonna be interesting. Got armies being formed. I'm not falling for that trap again. <laughs> not today. Not today, my man. And they got a hideout nearby. Samir, my good man. See if I can join through them or him, whatever. Oh, he's got a quest. Oh, you can't help me. Well, fine. I guess I need to be an actual vassal. Uh, nope. Okay, cool. Where is he going? Shit, one of my companions is in enemy territory right now. Not good. Where the hell is Kay is? Oh my god, you're going all the way over there. Are you? Do you have a death wish? I have to abandon this quest, because uh, that looks like impossible. You're going across enemy territory, dude. Oh, there's the king. If I talk to him, I may be able to join as a vassal, since I've done some work for him. from his oath. How much is this quest going to pay? That's what I really want to know. I think it's only like, yeah, it might be a lot because he's going pretty far. Well, F it. I'm going with it. <laughs> Let's see what happens here. Let's see how she goes. probably need to get more renown. I think if I look at my position in the kingdom, I look at clans, I've got like zero influence. <laughs> Very little. I'm still just a merc. But I'm getting paid, so I can't complain too much. We'll go here real quick. Wish they would reconsider where they're going. Let's join the tournament. I'm going to keep doing tournaments on the way. Try to get some stuff. One-handed weapon. Alright, I'm an archer. Dome down. Got him a good one. Another dome. Almost. He zigged when I thought he was gonna zag. Much little left. Good shot. Good hit. Get the shield. Ask you some questions here, buddy. This is part of 
hard mode right now. I actually have to block. Dodged him. Right in the face. Oh. Drungil, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Spear on spear action here. Gingerly touch tips. A little sword fighting with the urinal. Come on. There we go. Got under his, his spear. <laughs> Trying to listen to a goat rope. I'd rather him make it pass. See, that's strategic thinking right there. I want the easier opponents in the later stuff. That's the way to think about it. Let's just think I want to go for the the easy target. You gotta go for the weaker ones, or the stronger ones first. Take them out. Then later you fight the easier guys. Yeah. Mercenary guards on my team, that's not good. Actually, it is good if we win. Come on. One down. There we go. Yeah, now he's gonna be with me. Or against me eventually. Ah. <laughs> it's you and I, buddy. Faster than him, I think. So that wins. Ah, victory. What do we get? That sword. Nice. I will take that and use it. So let's look at our inventory. I get rid of the short sword for this use. So length is a little bit better. Not much. So we'll take that and I'll use the short sword. Maybe not. Maybe not. I'll just hang on to it. Let's keep moving a little bit more. Might take a while to get across the, uh, Enemy lines here. Gonna take it nice and slow and steady. Maybe fight some looters along the way to get some XP for my men. Joining them may be a good idea though to get some more influence. Because we're fighting the Western Empire now, which I think have been hurt a little bit by the Stur not the Sturgeons, the Volandians. I gotta find a diplomacy tab. I mean, not this diplomacy tab, obviously. I wanna see what the other enemies are doing. How are we doing against them? Strength wise, ooh, they have the advantage. Not good, not good. Well, I'll stick with these guys because. I could help them and maybe turn the tide, but maybe not. Yeah, they got a bigger army coming. I don't have the men to deal with that. Jeez. Oh, They're camped there. Oh, wait a minute. So the Northern Empire is besieging the Western Empire. Well, that might actually present an opportunity for us. If they take that, then I can uh, come back and grab my dudes. Who is it that's missing right now? Uh, Temur. Who's in pink for whatever reason. Because he feels like it, I guess. He's feeling, uh... Feels like frolicking a little in the, in the tulips. This guy 
is so slow. Why do you want to go all the way over there? This better pay me a lot of money. I'm basically going through enemy lines to deliver garbage to these guys. Oh god. You better not get attacked by them. I will abandon you if you get attacked. Smart. <laughs> That's a lot of looters. Could be a good opportunity. Deep behind enemy lines right now. This is a dangerous, this is a dangerous game I'm playing. Much further. Oh my god, still gotta go way over there. Well, we're gonna have fun in the eastern lines, I guess. Oh, what does she want? Yeah, we are low on food. Okay. Very well. I will consider that. I guess we gotta stop and get food somewhere. Let's talk to them. They probably have food for sale. Uh, I want to trade, my man. Your shit is too expensive. I don't want just dates. I can't subsist off of dates alone. I'll stop in town on the way. Go fight them. They probably have some food. And to die, brigands. Get some XP for our our noobs. Attack! Just gonna go all in. No reason to. No reason to tarry. Get some throwing practice in. While I'm at it. Directly. Right in the foot. Another one right in the foot. I'm really good at hitting them in the feet. Oh, I missed him. Good. Get in there, people. Come on, man. Get him. I'm soften him up for you. One more. So, there we go. Well, we lost one guy. Not bad. Let's take those looters. We might recruit them. That's going to eat into our money. I'll take the one, though. Oh, we got cheese. Nice. We got some food. And we were just barely scraping by here. Apparently, I leveled up. In pole arms. Nice. Oh, good. More morale for my troops. That's... Awesome. And I can spend a point somewhere. Where do we want to spend it? I guess medicine would be a good one. Get us up to level one, maybe. Eventually. Slowly over time. We're back to zero. We bought ourselves a little bit of time. That's a nice thing. Let's get across this bridge. And wait for the caravan. Yorig, you play a dangerous game here, my man. Where are you going? Get moving. Oh shit. Oh shit. It's a good thing I'm a very small party. I can outrun them. There we go. I guess I could raid the uh, villagers, but... I don't want to lose too much, too much honor, I guess, integrity, I don't know. Let's get away from him. Come on, caravan guy. I'm trying to make room for you to get by. Okay, let's go to Lysia. We'll buy... Rain is still expensive. We'll buy three of those, that buys three days. We can complete this stupid contract. And then get out of here. Where are you going? Where are you going to Sargot now? Oh, you asshole. He changed his mind. I don't know why. That's very weird. Couldn't have done that earlier before we walked through the enemy lines. Let's kill those looters. If we can catch them. No, I'm going to lose.
lose the caravan if I do that. We're almost to Sargot. We can, we can, we can clear this out. It'll be fine. How's my party looking? Welcome aboard, looter. Take two of you on. We'll go to Sargot. Clear this out. Speed it up. And hey, what do we get? Oh man, forty two hundred bucks. We're in the money again, fellas. Can I get no, I can't get any more. Well, that was uh totally worth it. Take back anything bad I said about those guys. <laughs> oh, that's good. Well, anyways, I think that's a good point to stop before I press my luck any further and get captured. But we made a bunch of money. We can head back. Or we can recruit a bunch of dudes here and then start fighting our way up that we could start pillaging along the way. Oh, they are. Oh, the Batanians are gone. Interesting. They've been wiped out. I wonder if they can make a comeback eventually. Well, we'll see what happens in the next episode. Hopefully this audio is better. It looks like it is. But hey, thanks for joining me, folks. Take it easy and uh, stay safe out there.